What's this? I was hoping to just shove it through your door and skedaddle. It's from Devil Child. Oh, don't call him that. <laughs> Sorry I went off the deep end. You had every right to. Hey, and that super soaker is going straight to the Oxfell. Oh, that's a shame. These plants could do with watering. <laughs> you look tired. Oh, must be my new foundation. It's meant to be pale and interesting. I'll let you get on with it. Thank Josh for this. Hey, you are the lodger sent from heaven. We all have to sing for our supper, and they've been so good to me. Hey, kids aren't all that bad, you know. It's not even nine o'clock. She's only trying to help. But it doesn't need doing. Well, over to the windows, but that's not the point. She's making me dizzy. Oh, leave her alone. She can't even watch Teddy without knitting or sewing or doing her flaming puzzle book. It's like she's having a pop. Now you're being paranoid. <sighs> she's doing my head in. We're just going to have to get on with it. Get on with it. I loiter at work in a four-by-four four cubbyhole because I can't stand the sound of the click-click-clicking of her knitting. And the running commentary on the news. It's the permissive society. I blame the parents. Is it me or is that newsreader mumbling, bring back golden honeycomb? And the monologues. I mean, you can hear them five seconds before she walks in the door. The woman's on a loop. Shut it, Molly. I promise our Anthony. I don't know if those plants are yours or Jimmy's, but I've snipped the top off one or two of them. Sorry. I thought I'd have my cover in here, love. Everything all right? Yeah. That's just well, man. I'm sure this is the wrong way round. Hey, I always sleep this side of the bed. The tea? Oh. You're not exactly the host with the most, are you? Yeah, well, all that wears off sooner or later. <laughs> You and me are keeping it real, kid. Oh. 